The First Sino-Japanese War, 1894-1895, was a significant conflict between the Qing Dynasty of China and Meiji Japan, primarily fought over influence and control of Korea. This war marked a critical turning point in East Asian history, as it led to the rise of Japan as a regional power and highlighted the decline of China as a dominant force in Asia. Background Korea at the time was a tributary state of the Qing Dynasty, but both China and Japan sought to extend their influence over the Korean Peninsula. Japan, having undergone rapid modernization during the Meiji Restoration, saw Korea as vital for its security and economic interests. Meanwhile, the Qing Dynasty, under the reign of the Guangxu Emperor, considered Korea to be within its traditional sphere of influence. Tensions escalated in the early 1890s as both China and Japan intervened in internal conflicts within Korea, with Japan becoming increasingly assertive in the region. Causes of the War Korean Independence Movement Internal instability in Korea prompted both China and Japan to intervene. Japan supported reform movements in Korea and sought to reduce Chinese influence. Tonghak Rebellion In 1894, a peasant uprising, the Tonghak Rebellion in Korea, prompted the Korean government to request assistance from China. When China sent troops, Japan also deployed its forces, claiming it was acting to protect its interests. Conflict over Korean sovereignty The deployment of Japanese forces led to a direct confrontation between Japan and China over control of Korea. Progress of the war All the Japanese victories, the war began in July 1894, and Japan quickly demonstrated its military superiority, particularly its modernized navy and army. Key battles included the Battle of Pundo, July 1894, a naval victory for Japan. The Battle of Pyongyang, September 1894, where Japanese forces captured the city. Naval superiority, the Battle of the Yellow River, September 1894, was one of the war's most decisive encounters where Japan's navy decisively defeated the Qing fleet, ensuring Japan's control of the seas. For the Port Arthur, by November 1894, Japan had captured the strategically important city of Port Arthur, now Russian China, further demonstrating its dominance. Invasion of Manchuria Japanese forces pushed into Manchuria, threatening the Chinese heartland. By early 1895, Japan had taken control of several key Chinese territories. Treaty of Shimonoseki, April 1895 The war ended with the Treaty of Shimonoseki, which was highly favorable to Japan. The main terms included, China recognized Korea's independence, ending Korea's status as a tributary state to China. China ceded Taiwan, Formosa, the Pescadores Islands, and the Liaodong Peninsula, including Port Arthur, to Japan. China paid a large indemnity to Japan. China granted Japan the right to open trade in certain ports, expanding Japan's economic influence in the region. However, international intervention, particularly from Russia, Germany, and France, the Triple Intervention, forced Japan to return the Liaodong Peninsula to China in exchange for further indemnities. Consequences 
Rise of Japan. The war marked Japan's emergence as a major military and imperial power in East Asia, while China's defeat revealed the weakness of the Qing dynasty and led to internal unrest. Decline of Qing Dynasty. The war accelerated the decline of the Qing Dynasty and intensified calls for reform within China, leading to movements like the Hundred Days Reform and eventually the fall of the Qing Dynasty in 1911. Increased imperialism in East Asia. The victory emboldened Japan to expand its imperial ambitions, setting the stage for future conflicts with Russia and China. Korea independence and Japanese control. Though Korea was officially recognized as independent, Japan quickly increased its influence over the peninsula, eventually annexing Korea in 1910. The First Sino-Japanese War is seen as a key moment in the modernization and rise of Japan as a global power, while it highlighted the weaknesses of traditional Chinese governance and military structure. Thank you for watching the video, The First Sino-Japanese War, provided by History and Current Events. This is Sarah, Lily, Gina, and Tony have contributed so far as narrators. Thank you.